energy, excitement, fun. It's like this game. And the Seahawks start off with their running man. That's Marshawn Lynch. London and Fletcher was there. inside there. 50% torn. So that's why you're probably going to see a lot of this early. That's Lynch, and Lynch bangs it through, and that's a first down. Well, Ronnie, early in the season, they really struggled to run the football. Well, the last three games, Marshawn Lynch is averaging over 110 yards a game. He's back into beast mode. And you look at those first two plays right there, sitting in the box here, you can sense that this guy is running angry and he's running hard. See what the white did for him last night. Oh, not a good night. Well, your, your Huskies had a good one here. They did. And Lynch, Lynch got off early in the first possession, had some nice runs. Another nice run, he'll pick up five as I, time winds down here in the first. I love the way he runs, okay? And I, I said it earlier in the broadcast, he runs angry, okay? He, yeah. He's trying to hurt you when he runs the football. He's not just trying to get yards. He's trying to break tackle, trying to pull those knees up and hit you in the, the, the chin with them. He runs angry. That's how Terrell Owens used to run after catch back when he was playing ball. But this guy at 220 pounds running like that, you don't want to tackle him. They seven points to show for it. They had that critical third down chop block that knocked him out of field goal position. Lynch inside for two. Down to Los Angeles. Our first up is Payne. Lynch, Lynch looking for the crease. Can't quite get outside. Nice scrape on the play on the pickup of five by the Redskins. He still gets a, a hard four yards there, Ronnie. I mean, this guy is a hard runner. I love watching guys like this run the football. He is going to kick and scratch and grovel for every single inch he can get. He's always falling, falling forward. You rarely see Marshawn Lynch get pushed back at the end of the play. He'll throw early pressure. Dump off Lynch. He's got a chance. A nice block. There goes Lynch. That'll be a touchdown. Flags and for Lynch, seventh consecutive game with a touchdown. So the turnover turns into points for the Seahawks. We've got a tie game here in Seattle. His career, seventh consecutive game with a touchdown for the Seahawk workhorse, Marshawn Lynch. Well, they caught him in man coverage. These two linebackers, stop it right there. These two linebackers have the two backs, and you can see right here. London Fletcher, Fletcher gets picked by Zach Miller, and it opens it up down the sideline. Like you said, a great block by McQuiston on Leron Landry, but that was man coverage, backs crossing in the backfield, linebacker working up to the se second level, setting a little pick that wasn't called and really shouldn't have been called because he was moving into his route. Really good call versus the defense that was being played. Good job there of really cutting off all angles of attack yeah. by the Redskin defense. Taking advantage of the takeaways, and the Redskins giving up the takeaways, and that turns into points. Effective points. And they go right back to the ground game. Respect to Tavares Jackson after talking to him on Friday, after finding out what he's been fighting through. What that's, a stud. As you said, that's Marshawn Lynch on the ground. We'll check on him when we come back. Tie game here in Seattle. They generate a new set of downs. Lynch back in, okay, trying the left side. It's not there. Arakpo jumping up, pumping the fist in terms of the Redskins defense. Straight ahead, second and nine. Lynch going helmet to helmet, head to head with the Togway. He'll be just shy of three or so of the first. There's a reason they call Marshawn Lynch the beast, Ronnie. Watch him here drop his head. Boom. <laughs> right over. O.J. Atagwe, who actually made the tackle, but boy, he felt it. When your butt hit first, or your back hits first, and your defensive back tackling, you know what? On Mondays in the uh, film session, you take a little heat from your teammates. What do they say? Those open field tackles aren't pretty. Just get the man down. And boy, helmets coming off. Lynch just putting it down, downshifting, and trying to truck people. Plenty of trash being talked on this one today. Maybe it's the turkey. Too much. Well, that's five yards for Lynch. Dude, we'll talk about that right after this. Under the two more the morning. Lynch. And Lynch pounds through for the first down. Get to the locker room. Redskins showing a deep zone look. 
to get a handoff to Lynch. Lynch, he'll get it up to about the 40. Boy, flags go everywhere. Personal foul, unnecessary roughness. Offense, number 68. That penalty is declined. Brings up fourth down. He said he liked the energy increase from the first quarter to the second quarter on both sides of the ball. He wants to see that continue to progress. Second and 11, Lynch. Lynch has a lane. Lynch into the secondary. And that's a first down as he's close to the 40-yard line. Let's see where they mark it. He might be just shy. Just an outside zone play to the left there. And patient, falling Robinson. Then he gets a little crease. It was a good block on the outside by Golden Tate. Looks like he's going to be a yard short. Yeah, they're going to mark him short. The guy squeezes every single inch out of every run that he possibly can. Straight power football. Lynch will power across for three yards and a first down. Slow to get up there. He's got to save his energy. I mean, <laughs> he's running hard. You know, talking to the, the Seahawks this week, the one thing they talked about, Marshawn Lynch, is the great shape he came back in this year. Normally he plays around 223, 225. He's down to 215, 218. Has taken really good care of his body. We can't do that. That was interception number 15 on the season. As the Seahawks go right back to the run game. And on a play like that, it's ridiculous. First to 10, back to the run. That's Lynch. Bannon. No, not a problem. And that play in the last second there. And in a game like this, a call like that makes for critical throws. Backside, Lynch. A missed tackle, puts his head down and still going, and that is what they call beast mode. He ran through Leron Landry. Well, I think the loss in weight has just given him more pop and more explosion. Well, yeah, he looks quick. He's explosive. He's got moves, I and mean, he could always run you over, and he's not, it's not like he's some light guy. He's still almost 220 pounds. But the thing about him is the way he just keeps fighting and struggling for every single inch. Yeah. You know, you can't get him going backwards. You, I dare you to find a play where he's in a pile moving backwards. He's always getting positive yardage. 93 yards rushing on the day for Lynch. This could put him over 100. As he's taken down at the 31-yard line by Arakpo. And he goes for six. He threw down the flat and picked up seven yards. There's a quick look there at offensive coordinator Darrell Bevel as the give goes to Marshawn Lynch. We'll come in to replace him, third and two. I believe Lynch got enough for the first. Let's see how they mark it. He ends up on the other side. But I believe he got the first down, and he does. And a great day for Marshawn Lynch. He's over 100 yards. And he's just gotten it cranked up. Well, he's done it through the air, as you saw in that first touchdown, little swing pass. And then the downhill runner running <laughs> over Landry there again. I'm sorry, not Landry. That was O.J. Otago. Just, he just falls forward, Ronnie. I've said it again. He digs and he scratches for every single yard. I'm out here from Buffalo a few years ago, did Lynch, and really needed to restart his career. Had some troubles off the field there and wanted a fresh start. And it has been a fresh start. And I think everybody remembers that Saints game, the playoff game last year, where he went into, as they say, classic beast mode. Yep at the end there had the signature run. That really put his stamp on this organization. It contains some pretty good momentum. Redskins finally answer after 17 unanswered points by the Seahawks. Now they answer on defense. That's Perry Riley. Second and 10 give to Lynch. Lynch will have a couple. They're fighting for the football. They'll mark it four officially. He's in the speed of the game. Secondary blitz. They give to Lynch going the opposite way. The Redskins brought Kevin Barnes off the right side, but the front side was able to hold it to a three-yard gain. They're going to jam these guys outside. Here comes a four man rush. And that's it. This year, when they needed to come up with sacks and stops on defense, they did, and they should be very, very proud of themselves today and the effort. Mike Shannon should be proud of the effort that his team gave today. So the Redskins will go to four and seven. They'll go into a tie, move into a tie with the Philadelphia Eagles who lost today.